Yeah, it's funny, everyone sees what I do for a living and they think it is completely unreasonable. I don't mind taking punishment to push the envelope. I think cold water places are gonna be the next big spot. No one's really cared to venture because they're too cold to serve. They're gonna be the ones because there's super storms going through there. And I think that's gonna be where the biggest waves are ridden. You can only hold your breath for so long. The safety equipment that's coming out, once it's made available to the public, it'll be able to take the average surfer from surfing a six foot wave to being able to surf a 10 to 15 foot wave. And I can't wait to see the expression on all these people's faces when they get to surf a wave twice as big as anything they've ever surfed before. Maybe people will be surfing 100 foot Nazare in Portugal one day, just on their own, not getting towed, just having this motorized board, and that'd be pretty wild. The only limit to big wave surfing is the conditions and what mother nature delivers. I'm ready to take on anything that comes my way. This is how I make my living. <laughs>